Hello everyone. We meet again in the English learning series, 30 days to master 1000 English vocabulary words. As usual, I hope you will grasp and soon excel in your English language skills. If you'd like me to make videos on specific topics or teaching methods, please feel free to comment below. I will create more videos based on your preferences. Thank you, and let's start the new lesson. Foreign Foreign, mean Belonging or connected to a country that is not your own. Use foreign in a sentence. Learning a foreign language is truly enjoyable. You can't expect to learn a foreign language in a week. I visited several foreign countries. Learning a foreign language is interesting. I work at the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Forget. Forget, mean. To be unable to remember a fact, something that happened, or how to do something. Use forget in a sentence. Don't forget to attach your photo to the application form. I will never forget your kindness. Don't forget to charge your cell phone. I forgot to turn off the TV before going to bed. Forgive your enemies, but never forget their names. I will never forget this incident. People have short memories, they soon forget. Form Form, mean A paper or set of papers printed with spaces in which answers to questions can be written or information can be recorded in an organized way, to begin to exist or to make something begin to exist. Use form in a sentence. Attack is the best form of defense. You need to attach your photo to the application form. The company was formed in 1982. Former. Former. Mean. Of or in an earlier time, before the present time or in the past, the first of two people, things, or groups previously mentioned. Use former in a sentence. Of these two options, the former is less expensive, while the latter is less risky. He's a former student of mine. My former teacher is from England. Forward. Forward, mean. Towards the direction that is in front of you, to send a letter, etc., especially from someone's old address to their new address, or to send a letter, email, etc. that you have received to someone else. Use forward in a sentence. I look forward to seeing you again. I'm looking forward to seeing you this April. I look forward to your comments on the report. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. 
she took a small step forward. Your email will be forwarded to my manager. Free. Free, mean. Not doing anything planned or important, or available to be used, to allow someone to leave a prison or place where they have been kept, not limited or controlled. Use free in a sentence. It's free of charge. He spends all his free time chasing girls. What do you do in your free time? Are you free tonight? Is this a duty-free shop? Friend. Friend, mean. A person who you know well and who you like a lot, but who is usually not a member of your family. Use friend in a sentence. Some of my friends can speak English fairly well. She didn't feel comfortable with my friend. He is an old friend of mine. I have a friend whose father is a teacher. I'd like you to meet my friends. From. From, mean. Used to show the place where someone or something starts. Use from in a sentence. She borrowed a saw from the farmer. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Where are you from? I borrowed this book from him. He is often absent from school. How long does it take to walk from here to the city hall? She'll do anything to protect her children from harm. Front. Front, mean. The part of a building, object, or person's body that faces forward or is most often seen or used in or at the front of something. Use front in a sentence. We shouldn't argue in front of the children. I forgot to lock the front door. There is a bus stop in front of my house. Let's meet in front of the main gate at 8.30. There is a small lake in front of my house. Do you think we need a new lock for the front door? She is standing in front of the mirror. Full. Full, mean. Of a container or a space, holding or containing as much as possible or a lot. Useful in a sentence. The field is full of wild flowers. What's your full name? That book is full of mistakes. The factory is operating at full capacity. Fund. Fund, mean. An amount of money saved, collected, or provided for a particular purpose, to provide the money to pay for an event, activity, 
or organization. Use fund in a sentence. He's good at fundraising. They set up a fund to support the victims. Future Future, mean. A period of time that is to come, happening or existing in the future. Use future in a sentence. She wants to become an actress in the future. My mother is anxious about my future. I will do my best to ensure that such mistakes do not occur in future. I expect a subway station will be here in the future. The best way to predict the future is to create it. Your future is created by what you do today. We need to preserve these resources for future generations. Carden Carden, mean. A piece of land next to and belonging to a house, where flowers and other plants are grown, and often containing an area of grass. Use garden in a sentence. They won't allow us to enter the garden. What a beautiful garden. We grow vegetables in our garden. This door leads to the garden. We grow many types of vegetables in our garden. Her hobbies are reading and gardening. He permitted them to walk in the garden. Tias. Tias, mean. A substance in a form like air that is neither solid nor liquid. Use gas in a sentence. My car is out of gas. How far is the next gas station? This gas is highly poisonous. General General, mean Involving or relating to most or all people, things, or places especially when these are considered as a unit. Use general in a sentence. My general impression is that it is very good. In general, she is a trustworthy person. There is no general rule for these numbers. Generation Generation, mean All the people of about the same age within a society or within a particular family Use generation in a sentence Today there is a wide generation gap between parents and their children Three generations see things three ways. We need to preserve these resources for future generations. Tiat. Tiat, mean. To obtain, buy, or earn something. Use kit in a sentence. It took me three weeks to get over the flu. 
It takes an hour to get to the station on foot. Where can I get my baggage? Do you get along with your boss? Crap him. Don't let him get away. It's gradually getting colder. On the way home I decided to stop at the store to get some groceries. Curl. Curl, mean. A female child or young woman, especially one still at school. Use curl in a sentence. She is an educated girl. The girl screamed when she saw the flames. She used to be a very shy girl. You're the most beautiful girl in the world. What a cute girl. Give. Give, mean. To offer something to someone, or to provide someone with something. Use give in a sentence. It's hard to give up gambling. Come on. Give me a chance. I advised him to give up smoking. Give me a hand. Please give me a glass of water. I will give you an example to illustrate what I mean. Class. Class, mean. A hard, transparent material used to make windows, bottles, and other objects. Use class in a sentence. Don't put boiling water in the glass or it will crack. There is a crack in the glass. Please give me a glass of water. He broke the glass. I'd like a glass of wine. Go. Go, mean. To travel or move to another place. Use go in a sentence. Where did you go last Sunday? Do you go to school on foot? I'm tired. Let's go home. Call. Call, mean. An area on a playing field that usually has two posts with a net fixed behind them, where players try to send the ball in order to score in sports such as football and hockey. Use call in a sentence. He finally achieved his goals. The crowd yelled when he scored a goal. He finally achieved his goals. He kicked the ball into the goal. You need to set realistic goals. Messi scored four goals. Good. Good. Mean. Very satisfactory, enjoyable, pleasant, or interesting. Things for sale, or the things that you own. Use good in a sentence. 
he's good at fundraising. My general impression is that it is very good. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I am in a good mood. Do you think he is a good driver? Are you good at cooking? <laughs>